Speak for Let's play Let's hit Dragoon! Sorry for some of the abrupt endings of this. When I destroy a boss, I usually don't have time for outro. For, for a very long outro, I should say. Anyway, um, that guy right there. You should, okay. If you've been playing along, you shouldn't be needing any more power cores. So, yeah, don't need to worry about that. But you want to destroy this thing. Trust me on this. It is very much in your best interest that you do so. Why? Because you get this power up. The um, infinite lightning, like in the last last um, stage. It is especially useful for like everything. I mean, the um, dropping down. The, the um, prehistoric um, creatures here. The um, boxes that come tumbling down. All that, all that nasty stuff that you just... That will cause you yeah, heavy, heavy damage. Otherwise, take the face nice and slow. As per usual. So this up here, um, these dark slopes. You can't walk up here. If you can't walk those. Walk up those. You can have to jump up them. So yeah, if you're wondering why I've been jumping up those, that is why. As the R needs some of the services, it in this particular stage that does that. It's kind of strange that this is the only stage that does that. I mean, it's it's a, it's a nice little pace control like um, thing going on in this um, stage. And honestly, I wish to be implemented more for those who are trying to rush a state, stage. And yeah, I don't want to get too much confidential or meditations of it. But we are already at the boss stage. We are already at the boss already. Already at the boss already. Can it sound more redundant? All right, it's pterodactyl. Yes, that's. I, I may not be this thing's up. That's the name that's, that's gonna be calling it. Uh, same with the, um, stage 2 boss. This thing can only be harmed if its mouth is open. How that makes any sense whatsoever? Uh, it doesn't. That's a video game. It's not supposed to make sense, can it? It's like, um, just even like, this, just trying to make a big deal with everything. Ugh. Okay. Now, while this thing is going, I do not recommend standing still. Have your ball, have your ball of fire ready, and just move backwards. That is why the second time around it will be lower, and that attack will be harder to dodge. You can't just simply duck to avoid that attack where, you, where the thing is just diving down. And there we go. We didn't even get to that point. Ha! <laughs> Usually when I play this, it never does. So yeah, we're going through here, we have a bunch of rocks come down. So yeah, watch your pace as always. I think I need to say any more on the subject. And, on the note of slaughtering that uh, pterodactyl, next time on Let's Play Let's See Dragoon, we're going to be exploring this cave that we just, well, stumbled upon. See you guys then.